The 716 in two minutes, brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers. Good afternoon, I'm Madison Carter here at 7 Eyewitness News. We're going to take you through the 716 in two minutes. Parts of New York are opening again today as the state's pause order expires. Orleans, Genesee and Wyoming counties are ready to restart their economies with phase one of the state's reopening plan. But most of western New York may now have to wait even longer to start reopening. The western New York region, Niagara, Erie, Cattaraugus, Chautauqua and Allegheny counties is gaining ground. Our region now meets five of the seven criteria necessary to start reopening. Our region still needs to see a 14 day drop in hospitalizations and hospital deaths from COVID-19. In Washington, the House will vote on a $3 trillion aid package today. It would put forth funding for state and local governments, coronavirus testing, and a new round of direct payments to Americans. The legislation, which was not a product of bipartisan negotiations, would stand as the largest relief package in U.S. history. The bill is not expected to be taken up by the Senate because of Republican opposition. Today, a sign of summer normalcy returns to western New York. The transit drive-in is opening for business, but you are going to notice some changes. The five-screen drive-in will be at half capacity, so there are going to be fewer cars, making it easier to maintain at least six feet of distance. All ticket sales are pre-sale, and the number of people allowed in the bathrooms will be limited. The owner of the transit drive-in says he's hoping he can keep moviegoers entertained and safe. It's a sign of a return to normalization. Uh, we want to keep everyone happy. So, you know, it's a balancing act. Tonight's showings are Trolls World Tour for the Little Ones and The Invisible Man for Adults. Gates will open at 7, movies will start at 845. Tomorrow, you're going to have another chance to see a special honor for healthcare workers. The National Warplane Museum will be running a series of flyovers spanning from Oswego to Fredonia. They're going to be led by a plane involved in the D-Day invasion in World War II. You can find when that flyover will be over you right now by checking out the map on our website. That's your 716 in two minutes. We'll have another update for you later on this afternoon. The 716 in two minutes brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers.